Hey, what's up guys? Grown the Hobby coming back to you guys with another baseball break. One that I, I'm in the boat that I like this break and this particular product. A lot of people maybe don't, but uh, I'm definitely not one of those. I always pick this stuff up every year and I think it's a very fun rip. I like the card stock and all that stuff like that. What I'm talking about, of course, is Allen and Ginter. So we got a little blaster here we're going to start with for this year of 2021 Allen and Ginter. Let's just cut right into this and see what we have going on here. I do have a, I believe, two hobby boxes of this on the way to me currently. So definitely be looking for some hobby box breaks on here. And actually, I'll show you guys the box real quick. So Allen and Ginter, the, the, the stuff that makes people mad about Allen and Ginter is that, uh, you know, it kind of has different figures in it, not just baseball players, different sports figures, different uh, people, you know, big in social media, celebrities, things like that. And then a lot of, like, random things like, uh, you know, plants, fish. Uh, you know, goofy things like that, which you guys will see here momentarily, but I don't mind it, to be honest. Uh, you're looking for autograph and relic cards, 48 total cards in here. There are the odds if you want to pause and check that out. But, uh, yeah, we are looking at 7 plus 1. I don't know why they just, once again, don't just say 8. Honestly, 8 packs, 6 cards per pack, so 48 total cards. And, uh, yeah, we'll see what we can get. Rip cards, I believe, 100% are hobby exclusive, so we don't have a chance at those in here, but I will have a chance when we do the hobby boxes. I love the rip cards, although I've never actually pulled one on camera. I'd love to pull one of those and check them out. But, uh, yeah, here's our eight packs. Maybe we'll get a relic, maybe we'll get an auto. That would be cool. Uh, hopefully we'll at least get maybe like a big rookie out of here or something. But uh, let's get right into it. Love me my own again. All right, so we're starting right off the bat with a non-baseball player, Mr. Pardo, uh, Jimmy Pardo, comedian TV host. So this is the stuff I'm talking about that kind of bothers people a little bit. Uh, I mean, I'm not a big fan of it, but it doesn't bother me enough not to get the product. Reese Hoskins, uh, Jose Rice. You get a mini in every pack as well, and this mini here is a far, far and away subset this year. So Proxima B It's kind of a galaxy looking card there and then of course uh, here's one of those other kind of weird ones rallying back the white rhino and last but not least a guy named brim which is a tv personality there uh from hardball and mtv and all that stuff like that so all right nothing crazy in pack number one pack number two andre dawson right off the bat a uh, guy named Coach or Koch? I don't know. From so he's got Sam Adams there on his shirt. I'll give you guys, if you're interested, you can check it out. Uh, Boston Beer Company Brewer Sam Adams. That's who that is. So Beer Likers, there you go. So uh, NG, man, some of these ones. Yikes. Baseball General Manager, I'm, I'll be darned. Did not realize uh, that she was... Uh... Oh, how the heck did I not remember that? Jeez Louise. I forgot about that. Uh, I have heard of her. <laughs> Absolutely. I don't know. I'm so used to all these non-names being in here. So we got a cartoonist here, by the way. Tom Bunk. We are very heavy here, it seems, in the uh, the non-baseball players here. And here's another one of the subsets. Uh, Maraud, I believe is what these are called this year. I mean, they're kind of cool looking, but they're not, you know, anything crazy. Obviously, you had George Brett there. Maraud reimagined. And then we got Tom Seaver on the back. So this has been a very heavy box with the stuff that kind of annoys most people. Um, <laughs> maybe we can change that here, get a big rookie or something like that. Mark McGuire, Alex Kirilov, rookie. That's a nice rookie. Set that in a good pal. Gavin Lux, second-year card. And then we got a mini rookie of Sixto Sanchez, and I believe that's going to be one of the uh, the variation ones because um, it's slightly different. The normal backs, I'll show you guys one more time, even though this is not a baseball player, Mr. Bunk here, the cartoonist. Uh, this is the basic design. These are called a variation short print, I do believe, this year. So, Sixto Sanchez mini variation. You can tell from that MRD3. That's how you uh, know that's that. Then we got the Holly for Arboreal. Oh, jeez. Arboreal <laughs> so, Appreciation Day. Holy heck. Like Arbor Day, basically. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And then Mickey uh, Moniak rookie card there in the end. All right. All right, Mr. Wheeler, Robin Yount, Brady Singer rookie. We got a mini, say rookie at least, of Nate Pearson with an Allen and Ginter back. 
Those are different than the others. It's just an Allen and Ginter back, though. It's not a Brooklyn back. It's Allen and Ginter back. We got Joe Carter, uh, historical hits with the uh, kind of game day at action there, and then Jesus Lizard on the back. Blake Snell starts us off in this one. Mr. Burl. Perez, a mini of DJ LeMahieu. And then, I actually like this subset this year. I've seen these uh, before this video here. So, Deep Sea Shiver. Silver Tip Shark. It's kind of a nice little shark subset. I do like sharks. I'm a fan of Shark Week and stuff like that. And then, uh, Hanson. Is, is that... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Nice uh, hockey movie store there. I didn't even realize that uh, at first. I don't know. Hanson and Parody waiting, waiting for that. Huh. Interesting. Playwright. Yeah, okay. Man, I think even when I know some of these guys, I don't know these guys. All right. <laughs> Corey Seeger. Tower of Glass now. Martinez, a mini black. Mr. Hoyer, we got a rookie card there of Cody Hoyer. That's called the Black Border. It's a little bit more rare, you know, than the basics, but not nothing crazy. Nice little card there for Mr. Uh, Cunha Jr. And then Freddie Freeman. All right, two packs to go. I'll wrap this up. Hey, there's a good rookie. Christian Pache, very nice. That's a good one right there. DJ LeMahieu. <laughs> wow, look at that. Old school Angels uniform there for my man Mo. Nice. Nate Pearson, rookie mini there. Birds of a Feather, the Green Wing Macaw. And Miguel Sano. So you probably can see why this drives a lot of people nuts. I'll be honest, this box is very heavy in the uh, non-baseball cards. It's a little more heavy than I'm used to it being when I open this. But uh, we have a few more of these. Like I said, some hobby boxes. We're still going to open them. Hopefully have a little bit of luck. We'll see what we can get in those. This is the last pack, by the way. So Yaddy Molina and our final mini. So Max Freed. Then we got Roger Maris historical hits. And last but not least, nice rookie card there of Taylor Trammell. So... Really nothing crazy in that box, in all honesty, guys. I mean, the main rookies, I'm going to say, Christian Pache, um, probably that Alex Kirloff. And then, uh, you know, we got that Sixto Sanchez mini variation rookie. And I guess the only other one I'm really even going to show is probably the Black Border rookie there of Cody Hoyer. I mean, we did pick up, where is it at? I'll show you one last one here. I think, was it Nate Pearson? Yeah. The Nate Pearson, uh, Allen and Ginter back variation. But, uh, yeah, nothing crazy, nothing of big value in this one for sure by any means. But still, fun little break. Uh, like I said, I'm looking forward to the hobby boxes where you have the chance for the rip cards and you're guaranteed at least three hits. I mean, uh, one of them is possibly an autograph, but for the most part it's, you know, memorabilia and stuff. But it's still fun. They come in these little frames and stuff like that uh, if you hit an auto or something like that. But, uh, yeah, you guys can see that when we do the hobby break. All right, if you don't mind, please do me a favor, like, subscribe, share, click that bell notification button to be notified of future videos. Lots more of them coming to you guys. As always, in the description below, you guys can find my email address, mailing address, and Instagram handle. Other than that, I hope you have a great day, a great night wherever you all are at, and we will see you next time.